Hi guys and welcome to Strength Universe. Lex Luger was dubbed a total package for among other reasons having one of the best physiques in professional wrestling during his era, but stay tuned to find out how strong he really was. Lawrence Fole, better known by the ring name Lex Luger, was born on the 2nd of June 1958 in Buffalo, New York. He was billed to stand 6 foot 5 inches tall and weigh 123 kilograms or 270 pounds, although more on this later in the video. Larry first took part in sports while attending Orchard Park High School where he played basketball, before switching to football after the coach said that he was better suited to the sport. After graduating high school, Larry earned a football scholarship to Pennsylvania State University, but after falling out with the coaches over which position he should play, he transferred to the University of Miami, where he played for the Miami Hurricanes football team in 1978, before being kicked off the team for trash in his hotel room. Upon leaving Miami, Larry played professional football for the Montreal Alouettes of the Canadian Football League. He then signed for the Green Bay Packers of the NFL where he would never participate in a game due to a groin injury. In 1985, Larry walked into the Championship Wrestling from Florida office where he met and was trained by Hiro Matsuda, and would later adopt a ring name of Lex Luger due to being a fan of the comic book villain Lex Luthor. Lex Luger went on to make his professional wrestling debut on the 31st of October 1985, and over the following 21 years he was signed to various promotions including NWA, WCW, the WWF and TNA, before retiring from the sport on the 26th of August 2006. Today's video is sponsored by Fountain TRT. Think you may have low testosterone? Qualified men can now figure out their T levels from home. With Fountain TRT, a testing specialist comes to you, then speak to a provider about possible treatment options right on your phone, and if prescribed you'll get TRT delivered right to your door. Tap below to secure a spot now and get your TRT evaluation for just $1. There's no commitment for treatment and all of this is 100% confidential. Just use the link in the pinned comment or description and claim your $1 test today. But how strong was Lex Luger? And according to Steve Borden, who's better known by his ring name Sting, not only did Lex aesthetically have the look, but he was freakishly strong. In a couple of interviews, Buff Bagwell has stated that Lex was the strongest wrestler that he'd ever seen, including in this one with wrestling shoot interviews who do some great content that I've linked in the description. But Lex, believe it or not, overall was the most impressive strength guy I'd ever seen. The first lift that we're going to look at is the bench press, for which the website The Athletic states that Lex could press 600 pounds. Although Lex himself has never stated a one rep max, he has said that he would estimate it to be in the mid 500s. And this tallies up with an interview that he gave on Macho Mecca. Now I was okay bencher, you know, I could do a bunch of reps of 405 and a few reps of the five big wheels on each side for low fives. In another interview, Buff Bagwell confirmed that Lex would do £405 for 10 repetitions with ease, and such a bench press would rank Lex as an elite level lifter in the top 1% of strength level users. Next we look at a squat for which an article in The Athletic states that Lex could squat 363kg or £800. I could however find no quotes or interviews with Lex where he states this. The most accurate information I could find again comes from an interview with Macho Mecca in which Lex and Buff Bagwell state that while Lex was being heavily tested for PEDs, he achieved the following. Heavily tested, and it caught me off guard a little bit seeing Lex as, as thin as I saw him. And, and I, I, I had like long yeah. skinny giraffe that uh, <laughs> length of time. I was 6'4 and about 245, which for then I was thin. <laughs> he did 405 for 20 reps yeah. with his butt touching his ankles on every set. And then you got on the extension and you put it on the rack. It was the whole stack. And just, just 25, 30 reps. A 405 pound squat for 20 reps at 245 pounds in body weight would rank Lex in the 99th percentile of strength levels registered users. I don't normally include wrestling moves in these videos due to copyright and because most moves are assisted in some way, but in these instances they're a good representation of Lex Luger's strength. 
starting with the two occasions that Lexus slammed Duke Azuna. The first of these was on Independence Day 1993, when Yukazuna reportedly weighed 550 pounds. Lex repeated this feat of strength a few weeks later at SummerSlam, where Yukazuna had reportedly increased his weight to 568 pounds. In 1996, Lex performed his signature move to Rack on Roadblock, who's reported to weigh 183 kilograms or 400 pounds. The final lift of this video is Skull Crushers, for which Lex is seen in this video using a weight of 92 kilograms or 202 pounds. Sadly, the video ends before we see how many reps he completes, but assuming he manages a minimum of 10, he would rank in the top 3% of lifters of the same age and body weight. Prior to making this video, I hadn't heard much about Lex Luger's strength, and wouldn't have picked him as an elite level strength athlete but it's clear that I assumed incorrectly and he deserves more recognition. But please leave a comment below letting me know your memories of Lex Luger and how you rate his strength. I've left credits along with my social media links in the description below so please check those out and give me a follow. And finally if you enjoyed the video please help to support the algorithm by smashing like, sharing the video and if you haven't done so already by subscribing. Thank you.